The first major barrier for me was I was very weak on my IT. My age and my qualifications, my qualifications put me as overqualified for some of the jobs I was applying for. At home, looking after my children, as uh, now I'm, I'm wanting to get into work because they're starting full-time school. I was just looking for the jobs over the computers, I'd never go and hand my CV in or anything like that, I just applied from over the computer and I never got nowhere with it. Usually I'm quite quiet and shy. My age as well, that was making me feel a bit not confident. So I've been unemployed for eight years. Um, I've had bits of work, on and off. I've had, I've had no help with nothing like my CVs, nothing like that. I've had no scores. I'm thinking, well, there's all young fellas coming up and they're going to be fitter, fitter than me, faster, and... And um, you generally lack of confidence at my age. You know, after working for most of my life. I was going to the interviews and so I was getting nothing back from them at all. And then I just felt that disheartened with it. First of all on this course, it was nice to meet people my own age going through the same thing because I thought I was just out there on my own. Coaching and mentoring, I came along and told them what I was looking for and they actually told me that I was putting too much on my CV for a start. So I've condensed that down and taken some of the things off that are not applicable to any of the other jobs I'm applying for. It's well worth seeing a coach and mentor. Guided me into what I wanted to do and how to get um, the skills and that to do that and what courses is available for me to get into work. The team's helped me a lot, the, the programme. Yeah, it's helped me a lot, it's like, built my confidence up again. Um, they helped me with my interview skills. They've helped me with a lot of things really. They've helped me with my CV. That was a big thing because being computer illiterate, I was having trouble with my CV. I've done like, first aid, health and safety. I've done lifting, and the other hand in, and actually team building as well. And we've really, I've really enjoyed it. It's well worth going along. I did manual handling while I was on the course, which helped me a lot. Got my construction to level one, health and safety. Confidence to work within the care setting, and the understanding of like the equipment and how to approach service users. Well, I've got my CSCS card, I've got my um, asbestos awareness, I've got the chance to prove myself on site. Passed my maths, my English, uh, my asbestos awareness. I've had interviews for me. Well, I'm helping others now write CVs and doing cover letters and things like that. Because I actually do a five-hour class here on a Tuesday and I'm actually helping them write CVs now. So I've got skills like that for always. So you go for the programme, I want to be able to get onto the site, prove myself. I enjoyed that visit to GTG, because um, I could have a look at all the new forklift trucks and that, and that was brilliant. And talking to the fella, he, you know, he gave me more insight into what warehousing was about. change it all together. I can do all this stuff, I can go out, I can I go worry about money situations. I feel a lot more confident now I've done the course. I've got an interview which I haven't had in the last two years. Currently doing some voluntary work within a residential care home um, two days a week which I'm really enjoying and gaining a lot more skills from it. I had my interview at Wiggle on Monday, I'm waiting to hear from them and I'm due to do a manual handling course tomorrow. I really want to clean the environment. I want to help keep it clean. Like the street scene operative work and stuff like that. The environmental health wise. I want to make the environment better for the kids. I'm very confident in myself, which I wasn't because I was feeling very low and not getting answers. 
now getting answers from other people it's put me on that high and I know that I benefit myself and my family. The children have impacted me a lot because obviously I want a better future for them and I want to get into work to help them and be a good role model.